Hi folks, today I'm making another recipe that is entirely my own. It's called spicy aromatic turbot curry and you won't find this recipe anywhere else. This is the turbot fish. It is considered a delicacy in Europe. It is a flat fish and swims at the bottom of the ocean. As you can see, both its eyes are on top of its head. I will lift the fish and give you a closer view. The skin is spotted on one side, as you can see, and is smooth to touch. While on the other side, the skin is white with grayish streaks. The fish has been gutted by the fishmonger. I shall not be trimming the fins of the fish since it adds to the flavor of the dish. You will also need one medium red onion chopped, one tablespoon of crushed ginger and garlic, some chopped green chilies and some coriander stalks and half a lemon. Add three to four tablespoons of plain yogurt into a bowl. Then add two tablespoons of tamarind paste into the bowl. Mix them together as I'm doing here. Blend it all in. Then squeeze half the lemon juice into the bowl. Put some slits onto the fish like I'm doing here. Two to three on each side will do. Turn the fish over and put in a few slide slits with your knife. Be gentle. Put some salt on the fish. Add some chili powder, some cumin powder, it's up to you the amount of spices that you want to use. Then squeeze a bit of lemon juice onto the turbot, like I'm doing here. Rub the spices into the fish nicely. Get it all over the fish and then turn the fish around and do the same on the other side as well as inside the fish. Then add some oil into a large frying pan. Carefully place the fish onto the frying pan and gently sizzle on each side for a minute or two. The fish is nicely sizzling now, as you can see. Turn the pan around, move it about to fry the fish better. Flip the fish over carefully. Give it a minute or two on the other side. Tap it down like I'm doing. And then take it out. Be careful about taking out. The tail has dropped off while taking out. Now in the same pan, add some cumin seeds into the oil. Give it a stir. Then add the ginger, garlic and the chilies into the frying pan. Stir them all together for a bit. For half a minute. And then add the chopped red onions. And fry them all together 
for two to three minutes. Break up the onions a bit. And then add some salt to draw out the water content from the onions. Keep stirring. Then add some chili powder and some cumin powder a teaspoon each into the pan and then add the plain yogurt and tamarind mixture into the pan. Stir and mix with all the ingredients like I'm doing here. Keep shaking the pan, keep stirring then add the coriander stalks into the pan. Fry them all together and you will find that your kitchen is filled with the wonderful aroma that the fragrant coriander stalks add to the dish. Keep stirring and bring it to a boil. Then add around one cup of water. Give it a stir. Make sure to scrape off any spices from the bottom and then carefully place the fish into the pan. That's the fish in the pan nicely placed now. Ladle a bit of the broth over the fish as I'm doing here. Get it all nicely covered with a bit of broth and then put the lid on and simmer gently for 20 to 25 minutes. After 20-25 minutes take the lid off. You can see that the fish is ready and cooked through. It's fully cooked and tender. Add one and a half teaspoon of sugar into the pan. Garnish with a few coriander leaves and it's ready to plate up. Pour some of the flavorful and aromatic broth over the fish and you have a fresh new aromatic turbot recipe cooked in the Indian style. Enjoy!